Uh, we've, we've come a long way. Uh, you know, last year, you know, we did some good things, but uh, I think overall we needed a lot of work. I think last year, you know, the season being what it was, I think paid dividends for what's gonna, what it's going to be this year. You know, we got the same guys returning. Uh, Tim, we lost Tim Ross, but, uh, you know, I just think that experience from last year is going to really, really pay off for us this coming fall. We've looked good so far in practice. We have Emilio Davis, who I split starts with last year coming back. We have Nick Jacobs and Kenny Greer at nose guard coming back. They've both split, spots, or split starts. So between there, we all have playing time, lots of it, and we just look good. And then we have a lot of younger guys that I think can come up and really play and help our D-line out. Uh, we, we look pretty good, you know, in my, my humble opinion. You know, I feel like we've really been able to, to offset the fact that we had one of the greatest receivers ever to play here, uh, graduate last season. And I feel like, you know, we've got five, six guys that could easily step in on game day and do what they're asked. Uh, like, we got picked last, so we definitely hungry. Uh, the teams that we play against us in the conference, de definitely good teams. Not a team that we can overlook, so we got to take each game week by week and prepare for the team that we... Uh, you know, so far it's been smooth. Uh, last year, you know, me and Tim worked together a lot. You know, Tim's a really good friend. Uh, we played well together. Uh, it, was, it was nice to learn from him, him in the years past. Uh, you know, I pretty much made, made the calls with him last year. Uh, it's been fairly easy so far. You know, I'm sure things will pick up once we get into game week and we start seeing a few more things. For the most part, our older guys we really have understood it because it'll be actually about two and a half years because it came in our spring fall or spring ball of our freshman year. So we're really learning the place right now. We're focusing on just finessing our techniques, but our younger guys are really catching on fast, and I, that's a good thing. Um, I don't expect that it will. I, I think that you know. The thing, about, the thing about playing with Will is that he, he got a lot of attention, you know, obviously. And, and I was able to kind of, you know, I don't know, I don't know way, the way to put it, probably sneak around. I don't, I don't know how, how you would put it, but, uh, you know, I, I don't think there's a big target on me. I think that, you know, the way that I move within the offense, playing inside, playing outside, playing number one extended, playing number two, you know, sometimes in the backfield. I think that that's really going to help my production, and it's really going to prevent teams from being able to key on me. Uh, it's going to come here in the next couple of weeks. Right now we, sh we just got done installing, so we're just trying to be perfect at what we do, even though perfect is not always the proper way to do things or the proper answer. But if you aim for, uh, like Coach Petrino said, uh, to be great, you have to be perfect. So if we want to be great, we have to aim to be perfect. But yeah, we definitely been thinking about UC Davis, but we still got improvements to make. Um, I'm just excited for this season. I think that, you know, we got a great team and that we're going to be able to compete with every team in the Missouri Valley. You know, not necessarily win every game in the Missouri Valley, obviously, because it's one of the best conferences in Division One football. But I, I believe that our team and the people that we have and how close we are is going to help us in close games and help us, you know, maybe be the difference in that three or three to seven point game and take that swing and, and use it to our advantage. And how long have you been growing that beard? <laughs> oh, I got that a lot. Um, since a uh, little bit after Christmas. <laughs> Would you say you have the best facial hair on the team? Uh, I try. try. I do what I can. <laughs>